Man, welcome back to another episode of Social Climate. I am your boy, Billy Cash. I've been gone away on a birthday sabbatical, but now I'm back. Shout out to the subscriber. Shout out to the notification click. And on this episode right here, oh man, we're talking about a woman who's deeply religious, deeply rooted in the faith of the Lord. And she loves Jesus. She loved Jesus so much she wanted to take her three daughters to go and meet him. Yeah, you can't make this shit up. Social climate. Let's get it. This podcast is brought to you by niggas who are generally concerned with most of the dumb shit that's going on right now. By the way, I'm your host, Billy Cash, a.k.a. Cole, and welcome to Social Climate. Uh, Socialites, let me tell you who you're looking at. You're looking at the face of 31-year-old Anna Segovia of Houston, Texas. One Sunday morning, upon her leaving church with her three kids, she pulls into a Southwest Houston car wash. For some strange reason, she begins to rev the motor up very aggressively, just putting her foot in that thing. And all of a sudden, she starts saying, we're going to see Jesus. We're going to see Jesus. And the car explodes. Boom. Now, at this point, two of the children run out the back. She grabbed one by the hand. But thank the Lord that the owner of the car wash was actually there to call 911. Somebody was sensible enough to call 911. You got 20 people watching this and no one is even thinking to call the police. This is crazy. But I have some video on this. Check this out and I'm coming back. Social climb. First, it's a chilling story that is just so hard to believe. Police say this mom here set her own car on fire with her three children locked inside. But thanks to several witnesses, those children managed to escape and now Marcelino Benito is in Southwest Houston where this all happened live. Marcelino, how did this all start? Well, guys, it's unclear how or why this started, but tonight a family friend says this mother went to church on Sunday morning with her three children. By Sunday evening, police say she was trying to burn them alive. The day after at this South Houston car wash, an owner, Gerardo Cortez, can't get over what he witnessed. She kept shouting, let's go see Jesus. Let's all go see Jesus, Cortez says. Police tell us 31-year-old Anna Esther Segovia set her car on fire with her three kids, ages 9, 11, and 13, inside. She revved the engine four or five times and it ignited. She wouldn't let them out, Cortez says. Cortez watched as the older daughter tried to flee, but Segovia pulled her hair and forced her back into the car. It was really burning, flames in the air, says Cortez. That's when the older daughter managed to get herself and her sisters out. Witnesses intervened to help the girls, but Segovia dragged her nine-year-old away from the car wash to the bayou, where a Precinct 7 deputy was able to take her into custody. Ana Esther Segovia, who I understand is not present. This afternoon, medical. Segovia was a no-show in project court for medical reasons. She's facing three counts of aggravated assault of a family member. Back at the car wash, Cortez is shaken but grateful. God didn't let this happen. I was at the right place at the right time, Cortez says. Every time he looks at the charred car, he thinks about how much worse it could have been. Tonight, a close family friend tells us she's a loving mother who just snapped. The good news tonight is those kids are safe and we're told staying with relatives. Now, that family friend tells us Segovia does not need to be locked up. Instead, she says that her friend needs help. We're live in Southwest Houston tonight. I'm Marcelino Benito, KHOU 11 News. Woo! Does she need help? This woman needs a shit ton of help. Meds, Percocets, Xanax, whatever controls or could slow her mind down. Because I'm pretty sure that this is not the first time she's had some type of episode. This is probably the big episode that everybody around her probably figured that was going to happen. You just don't snap like that. You can see a person unraveling as time goes on. And then anybody with a deep faith in the Lord always wants to see the Lord. But at the end of the day, me personally, I have a deep faith, but I'm not going to rush the process. When it happens, it happens. Man, prayers up to those children, though, for going through this traumatic experience. And God knows in that household how many times these children have been through the mother's manic episodes and no one knows anything about it. So hopefully Anna Segovia gets the help that she needs. Hopefully these kids can get some therapy to get past this and as always i'm your boy billy cash be careful and stay prayerful social climbing on my click like and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button yeah